Hi guys, what are we gonna do today? Today we're gonna do another embossing project, just really quick and simple. If you've seen some of my other ones, I get more detailed. We're just gonna be using um, one of my new stamps, but you could use any stamp. I thought this went really cute together because it's all black and white, but let's just get started. The first thing you're gonna do is figure out what stamps you wanna use. I wanted to do the word hot. So I am gonna use this farmhand stamp because it's a nice, tall, skinny stamp and I could fit more letters on there. But use whatever stamps you have. So I picked up my letters and I'm gonna do the word hot and I just put it on this thin map. I am using my watermark stamp pad, which is, I'm just using a Versamark. And if you have any questions, we did some other more detailed videos on embossing on dishes. And you notice my letters are backwards, but when you stamp it, it will be forward. Now I found for this what was really nice that I had got this trick from someone else, especially since it's a round curved surface. I'm putting this on. I'm just gonna put a little bit of masking tape on the two ends. So I'm gonna lay my mug and I'm just gonna stand it on here so I have my center front. I've got masking tape on the two sides to hold it. So you wanna really, it's gotta commit, bring down. I'm holding it with the tape and then I'm going to just press down on these letters. You don't want it to slide. Pull it up and we're gonna find out real quick when we put the powder on. And I'm using an extra fine black embossing powder. I'm kind of going for the black and white look here. And what I'm gonna do is just use a fine brush and wipe off any excess. When you emboss it, it will emboss up wherever there's any dots. So now I'm just gonna use my heat gun and emboss it and on glass it does take a little longer. You gotta get it heated up, but you'll notice when it starts. saw how quick and easy this was. Now look when we put it all together with some white dishes, our cute little Christmas village, you could do a whole setup. But whatever you do, I hope you try this and have fun. Mm -hmm. 